Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. So come with us today as we explore Mini Lima London and the Disney store. So first we went to Starbucks and I had to get my first pumpkin spice latte of the season. I also got this really cute pumpkin brownie which was delicious. It was like orange and brownie and it was all goodness. So we headed over to Mini Lima now. This is in Soho and it's a free shop to enter. It has a gallery downstairs but unfortunately the gallery wasn't open because um, they were doing like a book signing but it's free to enter so you don't have to pay and it is all harry potter themed it is absolutely gorgeous this was the book that they were signing it's the third in the series and yeah come and explore with us the detailing that goes into the shop alone was absolutely phenomenal i mean the wallpaper was very well themed they had artworks they had signed artworks books t-shirts you name it they had it all harry potter themed and then they also had these Minolima exclusive books which were a little wonderland themed little mermaid themed beauty and the beast but they're all illustrations from the people that opened this shop which i thought was phenomenal um like i said all the sort of shelves and everything were themed they had postcards cars badges buttons magnets and i even got myself a little treat i got a 10 pound mystery bag hufflepuff themed so it was amazing as we were heading over to the Disney store, we found this House of Secrets, which was again Harry Potter themed, and we thought, oh my god, this is going to be amazing. Let me tell you guys, this was overly expensive. For a bow truckle plush, which was probably like the size of my forearm, it was £70. So as much as this theming in here was amazing, I would not recommend buying anything here because it was super expensive. But here's what the inside of the shop looks like. I say, like I said, it was very well themed and yeah that's all i can say i like the theming not the pricing we then headed over to the disney store which we have been looking forward to all day and we love coming into this disney store it's the only one in london sadly they closed the one near us but yeah we went in and normally on the right hand side is where they have all the seasonal things like the disney 100 halloween but they actually had the princess collection dolls but we headed over to the left hand side and they had the cutest disney themed stuff they had this pumpkin spirit jersey which i loved um it was about 80 pounds dan found a spider stitch which he did actually end up buying um but yeah so they had mugs they had a sweet jar i dan found a grogu plush for me which i was very happy about um yeah i love this collection this year i love the kind of design i love the colors i love the pops of colors absolutely loved it then we found these nightmare before christmas plushes these are all 30th anniversary plushes so we found sandy claus jack skellington and sally and then dan also found oogie boogie and santa of course which was so adorable they also had uh, spirit jerseys jumpers ears they also had some christmas decorations t-shirts they had this really cute 30th anniversary figurine which was i think around about 100 pounds i'm not really sure uh mugs you name it for the 30th anniversary of night before christmas they had a load of good stuff Next we headed downstairs and this is more of like the princess kind of dolls, outfits, costumes, tiaras, kind of things like that. Um, I just love this little bit. If you were a little girl and you wanted to go and pick out a dress and a doll, like this section alone is just absolutely beautiful. But yeah, I love coming down here and just having a look, see what they've got at the back. They have sow items. Um, I was very tempted to get a pair of jogging bottoms, but I sadly didn't get them. It also had this Toy Story section with sort of little aliens and Rex and Slinky, so that was really cool. And there were some photo ops as well. We ended up getting the Spider Stitch and we also got a Halloween Mini. We headed over to Costa because we were very, very hungry at this point and we got a salmon fried chicken wrap for me with a blood orange drink and a gingerbread cookie and then Dan also got a sausage roll with a cup of tea. Here I am enjoying my roll very much. Um, then we also opened up our £10 mystery bag from Minolima. We got this really cute notebook from The Crimes of Grindelwald and it's this Hufflepuff notebook which I thought was really cute. 
Um, we also got this really cute postcard as well, which also had a bit of a shine to it. And then we also got this Hufflepuff card, which I won't be using, I'll probably display somewhere. And then also we got this pin badge, which was also Hufflepuff themes. So I don't think £10 was actually that bad. I think it was really worth the money. Um, it was definitely worth my £10 anyway. And this is what it looks like. It says, are you feeling lucky about Menelina? So definitely worth the buy. And then I also got this postcard mystery pack. Here I am opening it and I got very excited because it was a bow truckle and bow truckles are my favourite. So it was definitely worth the money. Our last stop off before heading home was actually to Selfridges and only because I really wanted to have a look at the Christmas sort of bit downstairs and I love the Selfridges Christmas section. It is absolutely gorgeous and I know it's only just turned October but I just couldn't help but go and have a look. They had baubles galore, a very happy man there waving his lolly. Um, I absolutely love this tree. It was sweet theme, candy cane sweets, you name it, they had it. And then across from that, they also had all the decorations that they had in the tree. I mean, look at those giant sweets. Absolutely gorgeous. And I loved going in this bit. Here is a closer look at the Minnie Mouse that I got. She's got a cute little pumpkin bow in her hair and her dress is absolutely gorgeous. I say, like I said, I absolutely love this theme this year of like the colouring and everything. She was stunning. And then we have a very flimsy spy dart stitch, but here's a closer look. And yeah, I absolutely love today. I love going to the Harry Potter shop. I loved going to the Disney store. We'll go back to Minnelima again to go to the gallery downstairs. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. See you real soon.